All right, guys, welcome back to another Star Citizen video. I'm absolutely gutted right now. In my previous video, I teased coming back to this location to pick up a load of cargo from Big Bounties. Um, I am at the location. I had to hunt it down. Um, but if you did watch that video, I'll put a connotation to it. We've got the little ship, the Corsair here that we were with. There's a little cave down there that we ventured into for a moment. Um, but there's no... Uh, there's the Constellation Phoenix that we travelled in. There's no bounties here. I guess the server wipes them. Um, which is really devastating because... Yeah, I've just gone part... Oh, hang on. Is, that's, is that the Connie? Hold up. I might be wrong here. We might actually have cargo. I thought we lost it. That looks like... A shell of a Connie, and I suspect. Oh no, <laughs> that's like something else. That's a. Oh, that is. That's a C2. All right, maybe. Okay. Ma oh yeah, there's some cargo. Okay, I thought we'd lost everything, but it looks like we haven't. Hey, I was about to. Okay, <laughs> so the ships are gone. <laughs> <laughs> the ships are gone, but the cargo has been left. Okay, I'm fine with that. It's all left here for us to claim. So there was a big reclaimer that we were looking at. Oh, so devastating. I'll put up a clip of, like, a quick jack. Please, select. Uh, the explosion of the uh, three ships. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. So this whole video is awesome now because we get to actually do the whole thing that I came here for, which is collect up all the money, cargo, and stuff from that little mission and see how much money we can make just from the bounty looting, if you like. So we did a load of bounty gameplay. We shot down the ships, and this is me coming later on with the C2. Um, I believe this has been nerfed recently. I feel like people were recommending this as the best way to make money in the game. Um, I still think it's pretty solid, um, but I guess we'll get a clear indication on how much money you can make uh, when we have a little look. All right, let's just jump in here. So where's all that cargo gone? Here it is. <laughs> Such an awkward ship to land. Look at it. <laughs> Right, so, yeah, quite a lot of cargo here. Nice. So we're going to just load it all up. And I'm not going to... Ooh, titanium. It's not really worth that much, I don't think. I don't think we're going to make huge amounts of this stuff. And I'm not going to sell... I'm not going to take anything that is... Um, let's just move it over here. I'm not going to take anything that's illegal. Because as much as we can make a lot of money from that... I'm not in the mood to go back to Brio's and get murdered again. Um, yeah, spoiler alert for the video. But we went to Brio's and then someone thought it'd be fun to kill us. So, not about that life. Ideally, you'd have a few people doing this. But I just thought it'd be a nice, chill video. Just see how much money we make, you know? And this is just one ship, which is pretty cool. I'm not sure what ship this would be for. Whether this is just stuff that fell out of the C2... Or the Reclaimer just died, but I don't know. Don't feel like there's going to be much money in the iron, but we've got the space for it. So the big thing we're looking for here is Quantanium. If we find Quantanium, we'll be quids in. Is that it? I think that's it. Yeah. Nice. Actually really enjoying this as well because we're by a cave and there's no one nearby and no one's gonna try and kill us <laughs> which is always a plus you know and obviously this is going to be a lot of work for not a huge amount of money but bearing in mind you get money for actually doing the bounty i think it's like how much is it let's have a look so this was a very high risk target so what would you get for that you'd get um about 20k, right? So you get 20k for the bounty itself, and then you get whatever we're going to make here. I'm assuming medical supplies is not illegal cargo. 
I really hope I'm not just chucking it out of... We're <laughs> chucking it in one door and it's falling out of the other. <laughs> just get inside and it's all completely like... <laughs> just fallen through the other hole. Right. Now we get to play Jenga with loot. So, let's see what we can do here. Uh, I guess at this stage, it doesn't matter too much. I really, really don't want to get pirated today. I'm just not in the mood for it. I haven't got a weapon. I have, but you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I just want to do my mission. I'll pay them. I'll pay them way more than what it's worth. I just want to see. It's for science, mostly. So I just want to see what it's all worth. Oh, satisfying, though. This new system of, like, stacking cargo or whatever is so good. Like, to think that this wasn't even remotely in the game recently. And now it just works pretty flawlessly. It doesn't work all the time. Like, sometimes the containers turn invisible. <laughs> and sometimes they glitch out or whatever. But for the most part, this works really well. So, there we go. Nice. Little bit of cargo grabbing there. Let's uh, get a bit closer to the C2 because I think there was some in there. And ladders. you got to love ladders. Right. Okay, so this was the C2. I can see some cargo in there. Or at least I did before. Maybe it's not in there anymore. Ugh. Came here for nothing. Wait a minute. Let's just double check. I definitely saw some stuff. So it might have been... Aha. Uh -huh, here we go. Fallen out, which it has. Kind of cool, like a wreckage here. So what we got? Some titanium. There was only two, I remember, when we looked at it. That is a parked ship. Look at that beautifully parked ship there. <laughs> titanium and iron. Sweet. <laughs> right, let's grab iron. Not going to be worth much, but it's worth something. And some titanium. Thank goodness for the tractor beam, eh? Right. Sweet. Let's see what else we can find. Right. Here's the deal, guys. I just went back and looked at the footage that I captured yesterday. Um, it's... None of it is... Basically, the C2's there, which was wherever we found it. But everything else despawned. So, bit of a sad situation, honestly, because it was really close to the, to the Corsair here. So, if it's not here, it's not here at all. So I'm just going to have a little... We might see boxes or something, but... Yeah, I'm pretty sure... It's all been... It's all disappeared. It was literally, like, right here. So... Sad times. Um, in that case... <laughs> can't believe I'm saying this. We're going to have to do some bounty hunting. So... <laughs> Buckle up, guys. It's going to be interesting. Alright, I'm going to be honest, guys. I'm not sure that um, the C2 is really a combat ship. Um, <laughs> so, I... This may be a mistake. But, I mean, it's got size 5. It's a size 4 or 5. I mean, I think M6A is a size 5. But it's got, it's got something. It's got some weapons on it. So, if I can take down very high risk... Uh, targets in a um, a little badger vehicle. Like, why can't I do it in this? A Karak. Oh, am I even going to be able to get the cargo out of a Karak? There's no cargo. Alright, well. <laughs> I did not expect this. Karaks are kind of hard to take down because they've got turrets again. Oh my word. There is a lot. Go is, it, is there two Karaks? There's two Karaks. That is absolutely bonkers. Alright. Here we go. <laughs> Let the whale fighting begin! Oh, this is hilarious. Actual comedy. I'm not gonna... See, this is the thing. With the little fighter, I was dodging a lot of shots. I'm not gonna be able to do that today. Uh, but I'm gonna have a lot more firepower, so I don't know. Trade-offs, right? We'll see how we get on. If we start... Oh. If we start taking hits, then we know what's going on. <laughs> it's like space. This is like the opposite of like, you know, dogfighting. This is just. Attack on shields. 
bizarre. Oh, I have damaged his back though. Okay, you know what? This is actually all right. I think I've seen people honestly have setups here with the M2 or C2 with um, ballistics. Because you only need to do a few of these and the size ballistics, you kind of have enough ammo to do the job. Also, you don't have to worry about getting rid of their shields and stuff, so. Wow, this is taking way longer than I thought. Shit. It's just quite difficult because I can't stay behind him the whole time. Like, neither of us are maneuverable. <laughs> uh, well. I can keep trying boosting to, like, get around corners and stuff. There we go. Alright, so he's done. Again, I don't know how I'm going to get the cargo out of that, but we'll come to that in a minute. And then we've got the Starfarer. This does have a cargo hold, I believe, so we should be alright with this one. So this should be alright. <laughs> well, this looks awesome. Hey, good stuff. All right, he's done. And finally, the actual bounty. All right, let's do this. Three, two, one, let's -a go. Attack on shield. But yeah, in terms of <laughs> this is definitely a decent strategy because they haven't really put up a fight. So happy days as far as I'm concerned. Yes, fly back to your friends. Weep at their corpse. And then provide me loads of loot. Come on. Would you die? Hey, let's go. Nice. All right. So we did the thing. They blew up. Hopefully, we'll just watch them crash into the ground now. And we'll see if we can get any loot from it. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Actually do what we came here to do. I'm not going to blow up and destroy all the loot, are you? No. Okay, good. <laughs> wow, that looks cool. So I'm guessing there might be loot in that first area. Oh, I Okay, I've only got one clip, but I definitely <laughs> bought loads at the space station, so... I'm getting better, guys, okay? It's hard to remember to buy it and also equip it, all right? Just give me a break. I really need to take out the turret gunner. Sorry about the audio, guys. Yeah, there's no loot in here. I don't actually think we were actually going to get any loot from this. Which is a huge shame. Oh, the cargo's in here, look. Ah, oh, Chris, you actual troll. Why? Ah, oh, it's so upsetting. They really need to fix this ship for this cargo update. Like, you can't... This thing is filled to the brim! This is actually devastating. Is there a guy in this turret? No. Okay. I think the only thing I can do, there's a couple of things I can try. I can try and, like, glitch it through the ship, which isn't going to work. There's no doors for this, by the way. If you're wondering why I'm, like, freaking out, these pod doors don't open, which is absolutely devastating. Um, I guess what I will have to do, reluctantly, is completely blow up the ship. I'll lose half the cargo. Um, but honestly, I don't see another way around it. So... Absolutely devastating. They need to fix it. CIG, if you're watching, you need to get on this. Oh, <laughs> kaboom! Oh no, it looks like the loot's still in there. 
Oh, there's some loot. Can I really not grab any of it? It's still making a horrible noise as well. Ah, oh, look at... Oh, okay. Ah, oh, the scrap. Seriously? The only thing you're going to give me is scrap? That's actually devastating. What is... I don't know what's making such a loud noise over here. Is it that or something? I don't know. But, um... Obviously, if we look inside now... I don't know if there's going to be any loot for us. I hope so, because otherwise the whole thing was, like, pointless, but... Doesn't look like I can get to anything. No! <laughs> Oh, that sucks so much. The only thing I got from all of that work was freaking scrap. And I'm not taking scrap because it's literally just a waste of time. Damn. So I literally lost all that cargo. Yeah, CIG, man. You need to fix that. <laughs> like doing a bounty. And I did it. <laughs> and I the target was to like get all the stuff. I wouldn't be so mad, but it's literally the only thing that is kept is the scrap. Which is such a kick in the teeth. Alright, let's see if we can find the other ship. And if there's any more luck there. Alright, this might be a little bit more promising. Looks like we've got some loot boxes. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Half the loot is floating. Alright, cool, cool. I find it a little weird actually how the ships aren't marked anymore. Oh, nice. We're actually getting some loot. Sweet! Let's go! Titanium! Lovely. <laughs> right. Let's stack it all up here. Not a massive haul from this ship, but still better than nothing, right? Earning an honest living. <laughs> Getting bounties. There we go. Rotate. I do, i got to keep saying, I do really like the way the cargo snaps on top of each other. makes life so much easier. Imagine if it didn't do that. Imagine. Right, I think that's everything from in here. Alright guys, uh, I can't find the last Karak, but to be honest, I'm not too bothered because clearly that doesn't really work, so I'm gonna go and get another bounty here. Hope that we don't have to go up against Karaks. Um, I'd love a Reclaimer because that is obviously the best thing to do. Uh, we're gonna be doing it Asteroid, so that should make my life a little bit easier, honestly. Uh, in terms of, like, moving the cargo and whatnot. So, yeah, we'll go and do that. And, um, yeah. Okay, <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. The thought of flying around an asteroid field, doing a bounty with a giant ship, it's a little concerning, but, um, yes. <laughs> I guess we'll have to see how it goes. Oh, a 600i. And a Starfarer again. Wow. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to think I'm going to take out the 600i first. <laughs> going to be spicy. Let's just see what we can do here. I'm hoping that I've got enough firepower that I can just get through the targets as quickly as possible. But there we go. Don't know how long it takes me to take out a uh, 600i, so... All right, here we go. Ah, oh, they're all attacking me. Space whales engage. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, man. I do have to be real careful. Like, seriously. We're very close to asteroids here. I mean, the smart thing to do would be to lead them away, but I'm, I don't want to get caught in this sort of situation where I'm, like, losing bounties and stuff you know like they disappear like they did before like I lost the third Karak which is a pretty sad thing hey all right first target destroyed nice didn't take too long uh who's next <laughs> the Starfarer yeah the Starfarer didn't take too long last time and we definitely got loot from him so okay we are getting shot a little bit, but it's not too bad. Whoa! Okay, that was pretty painless. 
And then last but not least, what I think is going to be the best of the bunch, the C2. If he's going to let me shoot him here. So let's see what we can do. Also as well, it looks like they're staying in soft death. Previously, like when I did the previous um, bounty, they kind of disappeared. They went white, whereas the collision alert. Oh my god, that's so worrying. <laughs> like literally. <laughs> um, so yeah, maybe they just stay in the game. They don't get moved from the server quite as quick as they do on in atmosphere. Maybe. Man, I must have been close to that asteroid actually for that collision thing to come up. Hey, nice. Is he done? No, he's still moving. I can't tell if I've killed him or not. Is he flying away or is he just in soft death? I think he's just in soft death. Hey, nice. So. Oh, yeah. Look at that cargo, baby. Sweet. <laughs> Jackpot, my friends. Let's go. All right, so, in theory, if I, if I line it up properly, right, I'll be able to um, just open up. All right, I think we're good. This is awesome. This is actual hype right now. Get out. What the frick? What? The thing just exploded! <laughs> I just lost loads of loot, guys. No! For real? I wasn't shooting! <sighs> Honestly, we just hit the jackpot after the morning I've had. Honestly, if there's, like, no cargo left, I'm going to be so upset. I didn't touch it. The thing just blew up. That's devastating. Oh, man. It's, like, barely anything left. This thing was absolutely full. That is actually so sad. I don't know if I can actually grab those. Wait, no. Hang on. That's that's not my ship. Where's my ship? My ship is... Where is my ship? What the... Okay. Hang on. I'm getting a bit... Just... Alright, can you just stop moving? Just give me a chance to look for my ship. Alright, that's the bad ship. My ship is... Here, okay. <laughs> it's below me. I thought it was above. Man. I'm actually gutted that I've lost all of this. Like, all of this stuff here. Can't grab. That would have been massive. Copper. It's ultimately pointless. I mean, it's a lot, but... I just don't know why it blew up. Server lag, maybe, or something? I can only think that it was, like, server desync, and then, like, there was some extra damage that the game was still kind of, like, putting in for me. Either that, or the NPCs are, like, getting really smart, and they're, like, <laughs> deciding that they don't want to lose all the loot. Right, okay. Oh, next ship. Yeah, it's decent, actually, like, um, previously, this never happened. Um, like, the ship staying there like that, so, that's good. Um, yeah, I don't know about the 600 iron cargo, to be honest. Let's have a little look. Alright, let's see here. 
Whoa, this looks cool. Damn. Look at that. Huh. Can I go inside? Is that a plan? The elevator works. Okay. Let's see what happens here. I don't have high hopes for this. <laughs> I'm just going to say it. I don't expect this to work. Oh, it's cool though. Look at this. There might not even be cargo in here, to be fair. Yeah, no cargo. That's a solid rip in China. So it would be here, I imagine. But man, spooky if you were like pirating someone. Alright, nothing in there. Okay, fair enough. Not gonna get something and everything. Alright, okay, so last ship here. Obviously, I don't think you can do anything with these. Maybe you can, but these are the old gas pods. Not gonna try. <laughs> maybe, maybe you could probably sell them, I guess, right? They're like weapons. But what we want is um, in this door here. I'm just trying to make space. Can I please? Okay, that's incredibly annoying. If I grab it, it's like, nope. How do we open this door? Hello? Big button. It says open. Whoa! Bloody hell! Careful! Ah, oh, the rails is a nice touch. Alright, okay. So... Not too bad. So if I can start pulling stuff out here... The scrap's really in the way. This could be a little bit more profitable for me. I think it's good that this has happened out in um, space. So it's easy to move stuff around. Um, yeah, there's plenty here. Quartz. You're coming with me. Yeah, I really want to be able to pull out... There we go. Because once I've pulled out one... They all kind of... Will help. Will go to where they want to go. If I kind of line it up and like fire it a little bit. So it's a little bit closer. I really should park closer to these things. <laughs> the thing is, in the cockpit, it feels like you're really close. And then you get out and you're like, oh, I'm like 300 meters away. So, yeah. It's more quartz. I really don't think any of this is worth much money. I say, we'll pack this all up and then I'll, um, <laughs> I'll take it to see how much we can sell it for. Oh, there's actually quite a lot in here. So we've got some more copper. I'm trying to put it all back on the grid so I can figure out what we've got. This this place is actually loaded. More scrap that I don't want. Just trying to discard it off to the side so I don't get confused. Um, scrap, scrap. Okay. Medical supplies, medical supplies, medical supplies. Copper. Oh, no. Yeah, I mean... Oh, Quantanium. All right. I'll personally deliver this one. This one's worth... Mega cash. <laughs> uh, you know what, guys? I think I like you too much. <laughs> I don't think anyone wants to sit and watch me play Jenga for half an hour. So, And Jack certainly doesn't want to edit me doing Jenga for half an hour. So, um... Yeah, I think I'll, uh, <laughs> I think I'll pause the recording and see you when we're all loaded up. Things are starting to get a little bit <laughs> weird, but just in case the server crashes and I lose all my progress, because Star Citizen, this is what I've done so far. I've stacked it beautifully, as you can see. <laughs> um, it's actually really cool. I've never done a whole... I mean, I've not done it very efficiently, but I've pretty much filled it up, and I think I'm going to have enough space here. Um, and this has been really cool, actually. I'm really hoping 
I might be completely wrong. I'm really hoping I can rock up to a TDD and sell everything. Um, I really, really hope so. I got a feeling, though, it's not going to work like that. Because why would it be so easy, you know? I know they're doing a massive economy sort of rebalance, rework or whatever fairly soon. So I guess all this stuff is subject to change as always, but... Ah, oh, man. Let's just hope we earn something decent. Because like, it's probably taken me, like, this recording alone is a 1 hour 20 since I started recording. And obviously I've paused it quite a few times, and you guys are obviously seeing the shorter version of that as well. Right, so now we're going to head to a TDD and see if we can sell any of it. Uh, there are some there, but I believe that's the illegal stuff, which I don't want. Cool. Not bad. Not bad. At least you guys have got to see it loaded, even if we get pirated and stuff now. Which will probably happen, because, you know, Star Citizen. <laughs> Alright, for fun, let's see how we do in a little landing here. Everyone loves watching me land. Because <laughs> I'm so bad at it. Let's give it a go. Is it, it is this one? Yeah, the doors just aren't open yet. There we go. It's, it's opening now. Happy days. Alright. Come on. Don't make me land on the roof. I'll do it. I'm crazy. I feel like this landing is a bit too easy now. Kind of can't go wrong, can it? Oh. Well, it did. <laughs> uh, classic. Alright, here we go. Nice and smooth. Barely flop. Lovely. Here's a fun fact. So, when I went to the terminal to store it, it was like, Oh, you need to claim it. No, I'm not claiming it because I'll immediately lose everything. So... I really don't know what's going on here, so I might have to, like, take off and try and land again. Honestly, this game has tested me so much today. I feel like I need a medal for getting this done. It's just been an absolute challenge, you know? A good challenge. Somewhat enjoying myself here, but my words, challenging me. Right, so I'll take off here. It's still telling me that's where I should land, so maybe I should try and land now. Maybe I just got in too early or something. I don't know. All right. All right. Landing complete. Have a pleasant day. Right. Okay. Now the doors are closing, so I think it worked that time. Okay, let's see. Honestly, if, if I can't store it, <laughs> I rage quit. Oh, man. Uh, store. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you. Moving to storage. Stored. Right. Okay, see you guys at the TDD. All right, so, new server. <laughs> Oh, man, I'm not even joking. So I landed and uh, the shuttles weren't working. So I couldn't actually get to the platform. Great stuff. So anyway, I went and had some lunch. Luckily, we were able to store the ship, weren't we? But then I couldn't get here. So new server, ship stored. Hopefully, let's see. We'll finish the video on a high. And we've earned lots and lots of cash. Hopefully. Here we go. So we go to... Our ship here, the C2. And we've got plenty to sell. Anything I can't sell? No. So I can sell everything. Awesome. Alright. So let's go with the iron first of all. Jack, top up the order, um, the amounts please. So 4.5k. Processing that. Nice. Then we've got medical supplies, 65k. It's quite good, actually. Not bad at all. Uh, we've got the Quantanium, 
for 25k. Wow, that's, that was only one box as well. Sweet. Then we've got copper, 20k. Tungsten, another 20k. This is actually pretty good. Considering it was one bounty this is all from. Oh no, technically it's from two bounties. Like, mm, it's like one in a bit. So that's pretty good. Quartz, 12k. Not worth a huge amount. And then finally, uh, titanium. Six and a half K. So, in total, big screen letters, we've got, we made from all that bounty hunting, this much. I'd say that's pretty good. It's like, plus the 20k from the, uh, bounties originally. It's not bad for a little afternoon session. It's pretty good. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.